See, he says that you don't want to fall into a preoccupation with the exterior. But the weird thing is, is when you have balloon masses and clown masses and shake your, you know what, masses, there is a preoccupation with the exterior. C.S. Lewis is an Anglican. He's not a Catholic. But he did have this to say about the liturgy. I'm paraphrasing. He says, when a man and a woman have properly learned how to dance a dance like the waltz, if I'm well practiced in doing the waltz as a man and my wife is well practiced in doing the waltz as a woman, when we come together and we waltz, we go forward, we go backwards, we twirl, we spin, we're dancing or down here in Texas doing that Texas two step. If we're two-stepping, I can spin my wife out, bring her back and catch her. With my hand, I can guide her and tell her what's going on and communicate with her. And our feet are doing the Texas two-step. All right? People are thinking, man, where is Taylor Marshall going right now? What is it? I thought he said my Novus Ordo and Latin Mass. Listen to Listen up. If my wife and I are good at the Texas two-step and we've danced a lot together, As long as that Texas two-step is happening down at our feet, the gaze between my eyes and her eyes, the smile, the response, the tenderness of my hand moving her in certain ways, all that intimacy, all that fun, all that romance happens in the Texas two-step, or if you're from Europe, in the waltz. And that relationship, the interior, not just the exterior, the interior is expressed from me to her and her to me. If you're dancing with someone, what if I'm dancing with my wife in the Texas two-step and uh, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to break into that electric slide. And and no, it's going to wreck the dance. Instead of doing a Texas two-step, I say, you know what? I'm going to do the four-step. I'm going to make up the four-step. I'm going to do my own thing. Now, suddenly, I'm stepping on her feet. She's looking down. She's frustrated. She's looking around. Other people are like, what is that person doing? They don't know how to dance. I stepped on her foot again. Now, C.S. Lewis, he didn't say all that part. That was me. But C.S. Lewis says, you know, as long as you keep your feet in the way that they're supposed to go, the waltz, you're following the rubrics, the gaze of the man and the woman the romance and the fun, the intimacy happens on the dance floor. You start screwing around with the dance or the band starts screwing around with the beat. Suddenly you're now looking at your feet and stepping on each other. That's what happens in the Novus Ordo. We all go there. We all expect this is how mass goes. This is what should happen. We go from point A to B to C to D all the way to Z, right? Ita Misa S, blessing, last gospel if you're traditional. The priest comes in and he starts making up his own stuff and blessing people with his guitar and shaking his, getting his groove on, on, up on the altar. Suddenly we're all looking at our feet. We're all stepping on each other. And the interior intimacy that we are supposed to have with Jesus Christ has been obliterated and broken. And that's wrong. So Francis is saying that the old way is a preoccupation with the exterior, but I would argue it's the exact opposite. When you have priests clowning around, it's making everyone hyper-focused on the exterior and we're losing the interior connection with Jesus. 